trunk show day one, and I've got the bubbles, the big beautiful ball gowns, and the bombshell brides all ready to go. I'm Haley Page, and you've seen my gowns on Instagram, Pinterest, or if you've been to a wedding in the past 10 years. I've basically managed to find a profession that lets me play dress up for a living. Welcome to my wedded wonderland of dresses. After the excitement of Fashion Week, it's time to take my newest gowns to our flagship store in Los Angeles, where one lucky group of brides will be the very first to try them on. Hi, Chelsea. Nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. I'm Haley. Thanks this for coming in. Morning. How are you? Good, thank you. Welcome to the best dress up ever. Thank you. <laughs> have we tried on dresses before? I have only tried on one dress so far, but it was one, one of yours. <laughs> was it a ball gown? Was it fitted? It was one of the big uh, ball gown styles. Oh good, and do we love the ball gown? I am really excited for the big flowing ball gown look. I love that. That's a girl after my own heart. I am a ball gown girl as well. I don't think I'm super blingy, but I'm more of like a lacy, um, oh, good. Okay. lacy feel. We like lacy. <laughs> okay, that's great. First, I'll have Chelsea try on the bijou gown. It has the ball gown shape she's looking for. I wanted to explore wearable lingerie for this look, so the lattice and rose cut lace bodice has a lace up corset detail that adds that unexpected feminine twist. Wow. It's beautiful. I like the top on that. That is really pretty. So, this is our bijou gown. Um, hello. This yeah. back is so gorgeous. How do we feel? Good, and I really like this neckline. There's a little bit of like a corsetry detail, which I like, it's kind of sexy. I love this tool here with this horsehair trim. This is beautiful. I feel really good in this. I feel like I could actually go out and dance in this one. It's sweet and sexy. Yeah. Good. The next gown is the Pepper. The artwork was originally hand-drawn and inspired by a Moroccan votive. Placement is everything, and this neckline shape required weeks of attention to get it just right. <gasps> oh, this was the wild card. Yes. Oh, wow. I see that smile. I, ear I like to ear. The, um, I like that you can, like, there's the... Nude underlay. Nude, yes. Wow. Right? Oh. So I pulled this one because in comparison to the lace, it felt like it was a good wild card. This one looks like a princess. The skirt has the horse hair, but it's nice and light. It has like a nice low scoop. I, I actually I like it way more than I thought I would. I like the cut and it's sparkly, but not too sparkly. Exactly. Right. I feel like it's a pleasant surprise. Like it's, it's very comfortable. It, it really is hitting what I was looking for. It just feels really good. Next, I'll have Chelsea try on the halo gown. From the layered guipour lace to the delicately tiered tulle, this gown is uber feminine and in pursuit of something fantastical. It's beautiful. This is the one that I saw in the magazines that I wanted to come and look at. Um, I was really excited for the back. I can see why. And I really like the nude undertone with the lace. That's exactly how you make lace pop, is by giving it that undertone. Because if it's white on white, you can't see the details much. I do really like this one. We're just going to watch yeah. and stare at you, if that's OK. Yeah. I, <laughs> I still I, like the last one, though, too. The last one was really good, too. Both of these dresses lend themselves to this classic A-line shape. They both have the horsehair detail. What is our favorite? thing about each of these two dresses. So on this one, I think it's actually yeah. the, back, the back, the, the lace on the straps. And on the other one, I really was surprised by how much I liked the sparkle. Mm. I, I guess I don't know which one I like better of the two. Hi, ladies. Hi. How do we do? Great. Um, I have a lot to think about. Right. I loved seeing the halo. Good. But now I also have to figure out if I'm into sparkles and beading more than I previously thought. I know. We like to make it as complicated as possible. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. You're welcome. And you look so beautiful in both of them. Yes. So go enjoy your day. It was a pleasure to meet you both. Thank, Thank you for coming in. I love the dresses. I feel like I'm close to making a decision, but I might need to think about it overnight. It's the most important dress you will own, so I need to think through and like uh, really be very careful in making sure I pick the best one. Hi, Jacqueline. Hi. Nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. 
So tell me a little bit about what we're looking for today. Well, so for our wedding, we are getting married in Costa Rica on the beach wow. in front of a huge tree. So and pretty. I want uh, some movement with the wind maybe because we'll be outdoors. Uh, something that is stuck in people's minds. That's so what little, I really am looking for. A wow factor. Yes, a little bit more exactly. romantic. Something people haven't seen before. Exactly. So very Haley Page. <laughs> yes, very Haley Page. Exactly. The next gown is the Keegan, which was inspired by a recent trip to New Orleans when I tried my first beignets. I wanted something that felt decadent, but also had that fluffiness and sprinkle of sugar. Yes, yes, yes. Ta -da! Ta -da! <laughs> Beautiful. You can eat more in a ball gown. Yeah, it can. <laughs> <laughs> you can also, if you want to tailor the straps a little bit better, I will need, yeah. we can fit them here. But you can also, this is not for function. It's actually just a detail. That's a detail, yeah. So if you wanted it to be more of just a spaghetti strap, you mm -hmm. could also just oh, remove yeah. this and have it be like a I wide I do strap. like that V, though. I didn't know if I'd like this kind of back because there is a lot of fabric, but it's so pretty. And even though you're taking up more space in this, mm -hmm. do you feel like you're still mobile and you can yeah, move around? Yeah, you can gather it up and, I don't know, it's just so much more fun to dance with. Generally, yeah. you like this better than the first one too, right? I think I do, actually, which I didn't think I would. <laughs> okay. Next, I'll have Jacqueline try on the Nirvana from my brand new collection. The Nirvana gown was inspired by the song Smells Like Teen Spirit. I wanted something with depth that steered clear of what is considered mainstream. I also felt the need to still keep her girly and chic by adding crystal rhinestones and pockets. Oh this fits you like a glove. It really does. Oh my gosh, this, this is magnificent. Right? This is from our latest collection. I love this dress. And the neckline, it has like that edginess to it, Art Deco even. I love the print. This is very, to me, beachy. Like, mm -hmm. there is not a single thing I would change on this dress. Oh, yeah. It's really oh, cool. Oh, there it is. Oh, there it is. Oh, <laughs> now we're going to cry. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. This one has the drama that yeah. I want. Where it's on the front and the back. I can see myself on my wedding day yeah. right now. Is this your you dress? Yeah, this is my dress. First bride that's going to be wearing this dress. I, that makes me so excited. <laughs> Which is so great. That's why I came to okay. try on Haley Page dresses. Thank you so much.